Yeezy, 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 just jumped over, jump me. Yeezy, 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 I feel so What's going on? Hey, Connor. How what's you up? doing? You're not coming in here with those, huh? No. No. Bruh, come back later. Okay. Two hours later. I think this would be better. Jump in, jump in, jump in. Them boys are the same. Jordan is right. Better? Hey, Connor. What's yeah. Man, now you can come in. Yo guys, we just got down in the basement right now. This is insane, check this out. So inside the basement right here, we have 1,133 pairs of Jordans. All right guys, so I'm here with Mark right now. Now he's gonna pretty much show you guys like through the basement. So over here, what do we have? Over here, we start in this corner on say the Northwest wall. We have the Jordan one. And this was my wife's idea to just go along this whole wall and then go around. So we have 23 different stacks, 12 high, starting with the Jordan 1s. Then you see they pick up with the 2s right here. Here's some that uh, people love to see. That's some fire. The off-whites. Then we have those candy pack 2s, mocha 3s. They keep teasing us with this. We're going to release them. We're going to release them, and they never do. Those came out in 1999. That's the year I was born. I like so, that. Then we have the threes. You see the Nike Air booty there. <laughs> then uh, you have your Jumpman. Here's another pair that people would love to see. With Thunder, there is... Lightning. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Lightning Force, 2006. These are the fours here. Then we jump over after we get past the world's greatest sneaker cleaner. We're shooting Rashid Nader. Nader. We have... I'm going to plug my promo code. It's going to be on the screen right here. <laughs> and you jump. Bostic too. Is that Caesar? Oh, yo, it's Caesar. Hey Caesar. Yo, 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 yo. Uh, FaceTime me on Instagram. All right, guys. So I'm pranking Caesar right now. I'm gonna say that I snuck into Jump Man's house. Is it cool if I call you Jump Man? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Bingo. <laughs> yo, Caesar. Yo, I snuck into uh, Jump Man's house. What size do you want? What? What shoe? Do you need any? Uh, yeah, you know what? I need. I need this original pair for Jordan ones. All right, no, I got those. I got those. You want these? All right, dude. I'll take those. And what else? Oh yeah, it's Trophy Room 17s. So I don't know what those are. Yeah, you're gonna have to direct me. I wouldn't know what these. <laughs> you have no idea. Like these? Yes. Those ones right here. All right, so I got those. All right, and what else? Put me on the spot now. I don't know how many shoes. Five. He oh, doesn't. Yeah, he doesn't five. have the Supreme ones. I don't think. Oh, yeah, the Supreme. Oh, dang. Yeah, I know. Uh, I just take those two for now. I can't think of anything. That's it. I just woke up. You just woke up? Mm -hmm. I, just I, don't, woke I don't. I don't know when Jumpman's gonna wake up. So. <laughs> What's going on? We had to get you on the <laughs> plane. <laughs> What's up, boy? So you want my trophy room 17s, huh, man? Really? You gonna get me? You gonna get me like? I know. <laughs> you saw the ones, the twos, and the threes, the fours, and then these are the fives these right are here. The five. Dang. Burgundy boys. They actually have a jacket, a shirt, and jeans. And then a lot of people remember these from the Fresh Prince. These aren't the ones with the Nike Air branding on the back. Great five. They really haven't begun to turn. And how old are these? On the back. 2006. These are like my absolute favorite oh, five. Man. The DB5. And I just got these last year. So a lot of times I, I'm unable to get shoes when they first release. You have to have and a black light with those, right? Yeah. And they actually come with the light. Oh, it comes with the light? Yeah. I didn't know that. Everything lights up on them. And it's even sweeter. You turn the lights out here, down here, and then it's just pitch black. It's beautiful. And yeah. All the right. sixes, then the sevens. Please don't call these the Raptors. The Raptors. Because these are the dark charcoal. These were out before the Raptors came into existence. These are from 1992. 1992. Well before your time. Young I man. know. I did. Well before your before time. time no. Young grasshopper. Sevens. Then my favorites, as most people know, are the great eights. Eights are my all-time favorite numbered silhouette. And I wish, come on Jordan Brand, stop playing with me. Bring these back with the red pull tab in the back. Because the retros we got have the black pull tab because they like to show respects mm. to the older shoes. So they always make slight changes on any retros that they come up with. So then we start with the nines here. One of my favorites that just came out, the Mellow Nines. They call me Mellow Yellow. 
right. Just because I, I couldn't get the Ben 9s, but I did have a Ben 9 low custom made by Astro Corp. How long did this take to set up? all of this oh wow this was done days weeks and maybe two months total Dang. with just a little bit at a time i did time lapse videos that i put on my instagram so at this Trump is just Man incredible Boston. so it, it took a while to change this all over but i'm super happy that i did it and shout out to the container store for the major major assist with this and i started off with 17 18 drop boxes just to put like my pe's in or shoes i didn't have boxes with i liked the way it looked and they just started going i had about 300 i was 300 in and then started a partnership with them they reached out to me and then bam take a little break in between the tens and moving to the 11s and this is a little display i have with the k54 fives is autographed by ray allen some of ray allen socks up top um then we go through some of the first retros and a couple of the ogs and this one i want to go back and show you it's called you know this shoe is the toe cap 10 from 1994 again before your time <laughs> this shoe was recalled because jordan didn't like the toe cap really I had already bought my pair and the stores were reaching out to people to bring the shoes back because MJ wanted them all recalled. I kept them. But I not only had one pair, this is the pair from Korea, right? There's another pair. Bring out the right one so they know it's not the same shoe. This one is from Taiwan. They made them in two different countries. I kept them because I like the toe cap and they keep rumoring that they're going to bring them back out and hopefully it's, it's with the toe cap. But these are, you know, some with the Nike Air. When I do events and get booked to do sneaker events, a lot of people like to see these because a lot of people still don't have them in their classic. So I go threes, fours, five, six, seven, and you know, I just went all the way up to 13 with some of the first retros and OGs. My 1000th shoe from Uncle Mike V out of Chicago. He's actually gifted me a couple pair of shoes and I bought some shoes from him that he was getting rid of. And then we have some Oregon nines and threes. And then some other college PE shoes, Randy Moss and Eddie Jones. Then we jump back over to the 11. 2000 was a great year with the snake skin. 2001. So that's when I was alive, but I wasn't in the game yet. And then you, you see along here are some of the first the originals and the retro of the Cherry, then the University Blue. They changed the names of these because you could no longer call these the Columbias because of the laws and copyright. And that's the retro and the original. You see how the patent leather oh, is yeah. starting to to turn. I don't believe in, in um, using that soul sauce and all of that stuff that, that people use to turn your souls back. The 12s. The wings. I actually had the wings brought out by a friend of mine who I saw his pair done and I really loved it. And he said, oh, sure, I'll do yours, jump man. Oh, so, he, so fire. Yeah, these, these, these are cold. <laughs> And you know that some of the shoes stand up and some of them you have to lay mm -hmm. on the side, but it's because some of them are true high tops and then there's right. others yep. that are mid tops. Yep. This is my latest pickup. So this is 1,133. You guys can tell that like he has a huge foot, <laughs> all right? He has a size, all these sizes are either size 13 or size 14. See, I would love to try some of these on, except they're gonna be, they're gonna be huge on me, all right? I wear a size eight. We cross over and we're still in the 13. Now what's your favorite? The eights are my all-time favorite. Eights are all-time favorites. All-time favorites. Then my second favorite, which is gonna shock a lot of people, are the 14. So then we go around here. These <laughs> are called the Jordan Mock. Then we go with the, with the 16s here. This is the ginger. A lot of people want those this come off? retro. Yes, the shroud comes off, shroud or a cover. So this is the look with and without the shroud. Here is the trophy room 17s. And this suede on here is mean. You know, you see that motion in the ocean. Motion in the ocean. Yeah, that's what I like to call it. <laughs> it's not the size of the boat. It's the motion in the ocean, all right? And what are these right here? The 17. These actually came with a suitcase. And I kept, like I said, I kept those boxes and the suitcases inside of the box. This is a shoe I know that you will wear, Connor. Yeah, I'd wear this. Like the Lightning. Yep, I'd wear these. Lightning 17. You have your little booty mm -hmm. here. Uh, no point intended. <laughs> <laughs> and we come around to the 20s, 21, 22s, and 23s, and oh, the yeah. Bentley Boys. Oh, yeah. Now, this is something I want to show you that I need my black light for. They have a code behind the tongue. 
And then your, your 23s, this is a rare pair. Not many in existence of this, it's called the Finale. People don't understand what, there's two versions of of PE. Player exclusive, uh, a PE that's made strictly for the players to wear and their materials are different. This happens to be a PE for Ray Allen and you won't believe the price that I paid for it. I'm gonna let you zoom in on that tag in a minute. The Ray Allen 15. <laughs> I've had people offer me thousands of dollars for this oh shoe because this, this is not rest in peace. This is Rip Hamilton. His PE 14. Try to cop something like this. Oh man, pulling out the heat. Thousands and thousands of dollars. At a time when I got these, people weren't really trying to get them. Bruh. People want to be known for having the most expensive shoes and all of that. And that's not me. Definitely go subscribe to his channel, guys. He's Appreciate about to hit 100,000. Are you ready for that? I'm getting close to it. You're close. I'm You're really, really close. close. I'm go subscribe. This... Get this man to 100,000. What a lot of people don't know, I'm going to put you to the test. You see this? Yep. This is supposed to be a two. This is supposed to be a three. No Can way. Can you see it? Two. I never knew that. And on this side, MJ. That's a real thing. Yep. I never knew that before. Some collectors know, but not a lot of people know that. Jordan 12 cleats. Now guys, if you look really closely on these, you can see the M <laughs> and the J over here. <laughs> what I like about this whole collection too, is not just do you collect all these shoes, but you also collect the Reedies. Still got the cereal in them. That's crazy. I, I never opened the box. I also have an autograph spotting basketball by, by MJ. Shout out to OG Sneakers. Now, do you collect any other shoes but Jordans? Bam! Oh, man. We're coming over here. Coming over here. Vapor Max. Look at that. Which, man, this is like walking on pillows. Yes, yeah, seriously. You just put some pillows on your feet and put some straps mm -hmm. around it. My wife, she loves Puma. Gotta so these are the, the all Pumas. red suede yep. Pumas. I know you know these. Oh yeah, I got the Blazers. And these are the Silver Surfers. Mm -hmm. So me and my little man, we both got those to match. This whole hook up here, shout out to the God, container store, that, that Alpha Closet System. They let me design it, so I got to be a designer for a day and design it the way I wanted it. And they had their designer and make sure that it would fit in the area. So I had to measure and give my measurements. These are jackets. That's nice. If really you look clean. in here, look whose name is on it? Michael Jordan. This was specifically for him. Somebody what? I know sent me. The... I'll take both of them. Yeah, these are these are super dope. So we just moved on from like all the clothes. We're gonna bring it all the way over here, guys. It's absolutely insane. Literally, like check out this basement. You you can't really like see it on camera, but it's just so it's it's insane. Jordan be loyal, low, do the right thing. <laughs> Spizzle. You know, there, there's so many different varieties kind mm -hmm. of, of shoes that, that people are closed minded too because mm -hmm. get caught up in the hype and don't want to get roasted. Those are so cool. Man, these are, feel how heavy they are. That's like, oh my like God, guys, check these out. Ankle weights on your feet. That's it with uh, That's the it with collection. The Again, guys, don't forget to go subscribe to his YouTube channel. I'm going to put it up on the screen right here. Yeah, and don't forget, he also does giveaways. He's going to give away one of his first Jordans ever. Boy. So definitely go, no. <laughs> <laughs> but I do do giveaways on my page. And don't forget to go check him out at Instagram. Instagram, What's your Instagram? At Jumpman Bostic is my Instagram. At Twitter, uh, Snapchat. So pretty much Jumpman Bostic at the end of his videos, he always has his like, his words, okay? Like you'll, you'll see what I'm talking about. All right, so like, what's your words for today? My words, always stay in your lane. Never let anyone get you out of your comfort zone and get you to feed in to anything that they do. They dislike something doesn't mean that you have to. Do. Always be yourself and never follow anyone else but yourself. And that's why I wore Yeezys over here. <laughs> <laughs>